Hey plant gang, look at what we have here. Uh, if you recognize this, uh, you're on top of the game here because this is malice species. We're just gonna say malice species because that's what I want you to recognize uh, when you see it. Uh, but this is a apple. This is an apple. And so uh, there are a lot of different kinds of apples. If you're only familiar with the ones that you find in the grocery store, uh, you are about to be open to a whole nother world because uh, there are tons and tons of different forms of this wonderful genus Malus. Uh, from ornamental plants that we typically call crab apples all the way to the edible apples that you find in the grocery store. So a lot of the malices are native to different parts of Asia, uh, but we, again, I just want you to know an apple when you see an apple. Uh, here I'm next to an uh, ornamental, but also a culinary variety of malice uh, that is upward, that's very kind of skinny and narrow. And this would be very suitable for the home landscape because of its size and structure. Now this, and this also does uh, produce fruit. Uh, very typical of malice, alternate leaf arrangement uh, with serrations on the edge of the leaf. And then some pubescence, either on the new growth or the back side of the leaf, uh, just kind of some of the characteristics uh, to look out for in the genus Malus. So why would you uh, want to know Malus? Well, first off, you know, this is used as a culinary plant uh, in some cases, and there are some apple trees that we grow uh, for the fruit. But there are other, whole other classification of apple trees or Malus that we grow specifically for their spring flowering nature. Uh, and those are typically called crab apples. So malice, genus of about 30 to 55 species of small deciduous trees or shrubs, and they're all in the rosaceae family, includes the domestic orchard apple, also uh, called the eating apple, cooking apple, culinary apple. Uh, but then again, there's this whole other set of malice that we call crab apples, crab trees, or wild apples uh, that we grow in the home landscape primarily for their spring flowering. And this can include different uh, plants that have darker, darker color foliage, uh, big apples, no, no fruit apples really at all uh, because they are grown specifically for their bloom. Here's a landscape tip. Popular genus for eating apples, but also popular as compact ornamental trees that provide, provide blossoms in spring and colorful fruit in autumn.